with uh, passive words or soft words and, and just throw it off, man. Yeah. You yeah. know, and not listen. Well, that goes to show you, well, the brothers that do speak soft, they have they have to be more direct. Like, hey, brother, you cannot do that. Mm -hmm. You know, if you're not going to be like, hey, what the fuck, brother? You can't be fucking doing that mm -hmm. shit, you know? Instead of being, you know, like, mm -hmm. there's, there's certain ways you go about it. Mm -hmm. You know, brothers find the balance, and, but brothers got to find the balance of um, the understanding of uh, how the message was received. Mm -hmm. uh, so like, uh, how the message was given and then how you're going to receive it. You know, how are you going to understand it to where, you know, how can I become a better Israelite? How can I get, you know, how can I, you know, learn from this? So this, that, I won't be getting talked to like that again. You know, how can I, you know, take those initiatives? And ultimately it comes into being, becoming a man. In this society, you're not taught to be a, be, be a man. You're not taught how a real man conducts. But when you come into this truth, you start to understand how a man is going to conduct, how a man is supposed to conduct, man. All right. right, you're so used to being with a woman and, and basically softening up for, for a woman's sake, man. Yeah, being a gentleman. Yeah, being a so-called, yeah, yeah, which, which that's, a weary, on a, that's a weariness on the spirit, man. That's something that suppresses the spirit, man. All right? Like, we're, uh, in this society, Esau wants to basically tame a lion. He wants to be tame lions, man. Yeah, he, well, he brother, he well, look what he does to the lions in the zoo. Yeah, he put them in the zoo, uh, and then he feeds them every day. What's the, the lions supposed to be looking for the prey? Like you know, get hungry. You know, you're supposed to get hungry. So then it makes your drive for food even more. Mm -hmm. So then you know that all those chem you know those uh, chemicals, chemicals that that that, that, that uh, entices the body to want to go get prey. It's, that's how it's supposed to be. We're not, hey bro, we're locked up, man. Mm -hmm. You know it's hard yeah, as hell to get a yeah. fucking woman, man. Yeah. You know it's hard as you know certain things we try to we try to hold try to keep. Esau makes it really difficult for us to do. Mm -hmm. You know. Um, let me uh, yeah, I got some more precepts though. Um. Let me see something which it says in Proverbs. Proverbs 13. Yeah, yeah, Proverbs 13 and 10. It says, only by pride cometh contention. Mm -hmm. Only by pride cometh mm -hmm. contention, you know? So if even if so if you suffer wrongfully and and you you want to you want to like uh say something or do something to that effect and the brother tells you to shamai, but you want to keep talking, hey man, that's pride, man. And it brings in contention, yeah. 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 Yeah, because if the brother's above you and, and you know he tells you to shut it down, you know, what, what can you? Yeah, yeah, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta suck that up. Yeah. Hey, and then, hey, all right. So later on down the line, we get all these men coming because this is an army, right? Mm -hmm. We get these men coming in, and then something to that happens. You know, you, uh, you over men. Yeah, you over men, and then that same scenario comes yeah. to where you tell a brother Shemai, mm -hmm. but you didn't Shemai when that brother told you mm -hmm. Shemai. So what? How is that man supposed to Shemai to you when? You didn't shimmy, yeah. you know. Yeah. It's, it, it's, it's all a triple effect. Mm -hmm. It's a, we're all it's all an example for uh for the for the elect to come in so we could build men up, man. Mm -hmm. That's why the brother was saying that we're uh we're we're in this army to become yeah, to become men, because this world had been teaching us from day one to be the gentleman. You know, when mm -hmm. when this this society is totally ass backwards, when they a woman doesn't does not want a gentleman. I ain't gonna I, I'm gonna keep it like, I didn't mean to say doesn't really a woman does not want a gentleman. They want a man that's uh, age. You know, hey, we're gonna go through this. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, like a, a man, man. You know, and it's it's hard to find real men in mm -hmm. society. Yeah. yeah, I heard a woman telling somebody on the phone, um, he's not a pushover, but yada yada yada. But they don't want a man that's a pushover, basically. You know, Con. And Con. Esau, man, he, he go back to Esau, man. Esau, man, I, you go up to some of these Edomites' houses, hey, baby, do you want this? Do you want that? You know? It, it, that, that shit is Esau shit, man. It, happy wife, happy life, man. Yeah, and, and when you when they when they finally get a guy that's nice and that actually listens, what do they do? They treat him like shit, and they yeah. run all over him, yeah, yeah. and then they, you know, do all types of wickedness, but the yeah. guy that's over there beating her up, mm -hmm. hey, hey, well, she's attracted to her. Yeah, yeah, it's like she yeah. go running back, you mm -hmm. know, it's just like, I'm in such yep. an abusive relationship. <laughs> yeah. like, yeah. yeah, she loves it though. Well, well you know, there, this scripture also applies with women because it says only by pride cometh contention. So when a woman is proud, Damn. you're going to deal with a lot of contention from her, right? Yeah, all right? You deal with a lot of contention from proud women, all right? But this ain't about women, but this still it applies. Everything is it's like 360, everything is it, full circle, you know? It's tied together. You know, it's tied together. Yeah, it says only by pride cometh contention, but with the well advised is wisdom. 
and the well advised is going to be the order of your camp because you got the, the the heads of the camp they deal with the elders and you know that's where that's where wisdom lies man they have that the that direct connection you know and it's an order man all right you got some uh, uh yeah i'm gonna look for it um let me see if i can bring this up let me uh this is another scripture that i just want to bring out real quick that i got it's through the spirit the brother's here man because um i wrote these scriptures down you know and then um like the brother's here man and you know we just you know just bringing this out just speaking about order and certain things because when all hell breaks loose things is gonna get tightened things is gonna get even more tighter man all right you see that the lord is tightening up this thing man and the lord is sifting in israel like um, like the elder apostle said in the video he was watching earlier the lord is sifting israel man all right guys are gonna get kicked out all right this is um Psalm 37 and 37, it says, Mark the perfect man, and behold the upright, for the end of that man is peace. And the word mark, that word goes back to the word of, uh, believe it's shamar. It means keep watch. All right, so the men of renown that's in the camps, the elders, you got to watch those brothers to see how they conduct themselves and try to model yourself after those brothers, man. All right, but you know, you're not going to, be a complete copycat but you know you're going to do it in a way where you know it's similar you know you're going to take heed to these things man that they do all right because it's very important to the body everything that you do is done for the body of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah the order in the camps all right it says mark the perfect man and behold the upright for the end of that man is peace all right but the transgressors shall be destroyed together the end of the wicked shall be cut off. Then we coming into that time where the Lord is going to cut off the wicked. All right? And we want to be on the side of the righteous. Lord's will, we want to be a part of that uh, great uh, crowning ceremony that Yahweh Shah is going to bring to his men, his, to his elect. All right? The 144,000. All right? You got um, No, I don't. I, I lost it. I was going to. Uh, uh, let me uh, get it up. I think I got another scripture real quick. Yeah, cause what? Well, what I was looking for was uh was uh, basically when um ser serving under great men, uh Salakia. Yeah. When you when you we're being built up, right? So then when we're when we're built to a certain level, we're able to serve great men. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. you know, uh, I you know uh case in point, you know, you how we shot when he comes. We're gonna to have to serve him, you know. Do do things that he tells us to do, and we gotta do, we gotta already know things to be able to even serve at that level, you mm -hmm. know. It's like well, it goes to the even entertainment center, the entertainment world, or like the restaurant industry. You can't just go into some uh, some real fancy restaurant and you want to become a server, yeah, or or uh, maybe top a, chef, yeah, or chef. Mm -hmm. and, you know, you gotta you gotta already know things to where like things is moving fast, so yeah. you gotta know like. This needs to be done at this time because people, uh, America's really impatient. So if you go, if you order that food, they 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 expect a, a steak that takes an hour to, that takes an hour to be cooked. They want it done in like fifteen or ten, you know. But that's that's the wickedness of the society. But hey, man, it's all, it also it's all about decency and in order. There's mm -hmm. certain steps you have to take to be built up in this truth, you know, this thing of ours. Mm -hmm. So in, in order in order to take in order to take those steps, you gotta suck up that pride, put that bitch in a bottle, mm -hmm. and throw that bitch in the ocean somewhere, mm -hmm. and then just like listen, take those words and just just. Keep. That's what the brother said to me. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna pray that I'm a man of the Lord, and I'm I'm gonna continue to read these these words out of mm -hmm. the scriptures and teach the elect. And then I'm I'm yeah, we're here to serve the brothers, man. Mm -hmm. If the brother, hey man, that hey that goes to show you uh uh when, uh pride. When when tension comes, it's, it's, it's pride, man. Mm -hmm. You know, pride. When when there's pride, it's come to contention because the, a man doesn't believe something uh, another man has said, or maybe you had said something and the brother took it out of proportion mm -hmm. to where he 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 you had said something. It's like, oh no nah, no nah, brother, I ain't meaning like that. And then like the brother like you know he's not really understanding mm -hmm. it, but like hey, sometimes you just gotta let it go, man. You know, and just pray to the Lord, like give it up to the Lord, man. You know. It's, it's hard, it's easier than said than done because we both been through it, you know. Mm -hmm. There's brothers that's going through it right now, you know, there's certain things that's, 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 that's said and it's like, uh, 
you know, brothers, like, ah, let me take that back. That's why some, hey, this is best to just hold your tongue and then speak, you know, have, have all, okay, uh, just have all your sentences brief, you know, get in there and get out, you know, mm -hmm. this time, hey, we're here to fuck up, bro, mm -hmm. and, you know, we, we would bring, uh, brother Pashad brought that out and, uh, on, on Saturday, you know, uh, with, hey, man, that, the only way to be built up is to mess up, you know, mm -hmm. and that's your, that's your best learning, oh, and actually, it was on the live stream, too, that's, those are your best learning, uh, yeah. uh abilities, yeah, when, you, when you mess up, yeah. You know, because when you mess up, you, you know, you know you get yeah, yeah, you know what step you took to mess up. So now you want to correct it. I don't do this no more to get into the same position, you know. But I mean, we, if you ain't got nothing else. Uh, yeah, uh, bring that. many mighty men have, uh, this is Ecclesiasticus 11 and 6. Many mighty men have been greatly discouraged. And Arnold, oh, no, nope, that was not it. Let me read down a little. So I get my son. Nah, that wasn't it. Damn it, man. Damn it, Salah here. Mm. But yeah, yeah, that was, yeah. I don't want I'm, I'm messing it up right now. Come, come. Hey, but uh, we're going to give all praises to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shah, by Hashem, Rakakadash, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and until the next episode, uh, Lord's will, a hey, Shalom, you know? A hey, Shalom.